2021 was indeed an eventful year for Tesla, as the company unveiled some of its most ambitious products with the Cybertruck. Elon also tweeted about the highly anticipated Tesla electric yacht that will meet production demands, especially where its batteries are concerned. In this video, we will be talking about Tesla's new Terra factory, so watch this video to the end because it promises to be interesting. Tesla's Terra factory, known as Giga Texas, is built at a price of $1 billion. This factory will also spread across 5 million square feet. If a factory that's moving at, say, twice the speed of another factory is equivalent to two factories, basically. And the, the company that will be successful uh, is the co company that, with one factory, can accomplish what other companies take two or three or four factories to do. Elon Musk says it will be more than just a factory. Parts of it will be open to the public with boardwalks, streams, and hiking trails. The Tesla CEO promises to make it a paradise of nature for everyone to love. Giga Texas has already received approval from several government agencies and a tax cut of $50 million from state authorities. How amazing! Tesla's new Terra factory will be in Austin, Texas. The new Tesla Terra factory is built on 2,100 acres of land in Delvel, near Austin, Texas. This factory is just east of Austin Bergstrom International Airport. Within a few years, Tesla has unraveled some plans for electric vehicles which have already hit the market. Last year, the company's breakthrough in battery technology was fortified by the construction of four gigafactories. And Tesla Nevada has the largest footprint of the lot. The production company at Tesla Nevada is 35 gigawatt hours, which produces the battery packs used for the company's electric vehicles. After unveiling the Cybertruck, the Tesla CEO felt the need to have a larger facility with a terawatt hour capacity. This will be a 1,000 gigawatt hour facility, and this facility is large enough to fit 2,080 gigafactories in it. Construction underway. The construction for the Terra factory commenced on January 19, 2021, with foundations being poured with three gigapress, high press die casting machines, which are located on the northeast corner of the property. They had already gathered the components, and the first gigapress had already been fixed. The construction was already in full swing by March 2021, and several areas like the northeast corner had already been completed. Workers were spotted rolling their own metal tubes at the water treatment facility. The facility's internal wall already had blue paneling installed. Various deliveries of components, tools, framing, and ducting materials were rolling in every day, which also included stair sections with handrails. Robots arrived consistently and were spotted out in the open, waiting to get fitted at the robot storage. It will create 5,000 jobs. When the Terra factory gets fully completed, it will create around 5,000 jobs over four years. This is one big thing that Elon Musk wants to execute. The company plans to hire about 5,000 workers, with salaries averaging up to $47,147. They were looking at a wide range of job profiles, all beginning from entry-level positions at a starting salary of $35,000 to more specialized positions that will pay even more. The Terra factory will handle the production of its batteries, the Cybertruck, the Tesla Semi, the Model Y yacht, and the Model 3 electric car. However, we should be aware that the primary aim of the Terra factory will be the production of batteries. Integration of Tesla's secret battery technology. Tesla has been trying its best to ensure its Terra factory lives up to standard. Many people do not know that the factory will ultimately integrate Tesla's secret technology, also known as Roadrunner. Roadrunner is the main driving technology behind battery production, and the prices are expected to decrease by $100 per kilowatt hour. Regarding the production of electric vehicles, there would be a general assembly line set up in the factory. This was to assemble components coming in from other gigafactories worldwide, just in time for the Cybertruck production scheduled for late 2021. The Tesla CEO also wanted the Terra factory to produce model-wise in the exact time frame. While some still felt it wasn't feasible, the production had already begun within a year of opening. You should know that everything is possible if you have a man like Elon at the technological line. The arrival of components. Continuing through April 14, 2021, some more components and accessories constantly arrived at the facility. The roof installation kept expanding with wall sheathing and wall installation work was executed in different sections around the factory. An extensive gas line was installed in the gigapress area with backfilling in the excavated site which will be used to bury the pipeline. New footings were also installed in various areas. The south side was also expanded, 
and steel columns were recently erected in the latest section of the site. There have been many executions on this site. As we speak, the battery cell production area is expanding north. Electrical fencing around the electrical substation has also been established. We hope to see more developed substations as construction progresses. Introduction of Lithium Mining Tesla had already partnered with various firms like Canada's Giga Metals. This was to outsource various metals. The company also aimed to build a lithium hydroxide chemical plant to support the Terra factory's battery operations. Meanwhile, there has been a big change in this regard, a place called Lithium Valley. This place would be an abundant source of material, which situates between Oregon and Nevada. Having a proper mining operation set up, Tesla's Terra factory is expected to be more self-reliant. And now the big question is if there would be enough available lithium or not. We should note that lithium is the third most common element in the world, and with the free hydrogen chemical plant. What then is next for Tesla? Well, Tesla might just tap into the resource that could significantly impact the Terra factory. We hope you find this information about Tesla interesting. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.